Hey guys, welcome back to another new video. So in this video, I'm going to try Pixel Plus UI on my Redmi Note 8. So I have uh, already tried Pixel Experience ROM, Pixel OS, and also I think uh, Havoc and Arrow OS, which are almost similar ROMs. So currently I am using Project Elixir ROM, which is good, but there is a problem. I have reviewed this ROM. Uh, if you like this ROM, you can check the video so today we are going to try um pixel uh plus ui and i i will try to find the difference between pixel os and pixel experience rom so let's um start the installation process so before uh, uh starting installation process uh, i want to say that if you are want to try this rom the link will be in the description below and uh, the the main thing is that if you want to install this ROM, please uh, don't do dirty flush. Uh, just uh, clean all and flush the ROM because uh, sometimes if you don't clean your ROM and flush the ROM, um, then you may have get some problems. So better not to get the problem. Just back up your data and flush the clean ROM. So let's start the process. So I will be first forwarding this uh, installation process because it's same for all the ROMs, and I usually do these things same same way. So let's start the installation process. in the ROM now uh, as you can see the home screen and the apps so let's check uh, what apps we are getting uh, with this ROM so uh, as you can see right after we can see that uh, we are getting MIUI camera with uh, pixel plus ROM so if you are looking for a stable ROM which is based on IOSP and if you want MIUI camera included with that ROM so you can try pixel plus OS so pixel plus UI actually so as you can see here we have uh, MIUI camera and other apps like Google Play Store and record and other things so it's uh, based on OSP and you are getting minimal G apps uh, which uh, as you can see here so let's check our uh, Android version and also our security patch level so if i go about phone so as you can see it's based on android 12 and pixel plus ui android 12 and pixel plus ui version is 4.3 you can see here and you can flash it in redmi note 8 and 8t so both of both of the phone can can be flashed with this rom so and the security patch level is February 2022, which is uh, last month one. So, which is from the last uh, last month. And let's go back and check other things. So we are get, we are getting Xiaomi parts with this ROM. So we are getting Xiaomi parts with this ROM and also uh, we are getting little customization. So you can see here there is option of pixelizer. So where you can customize a few of the things like uh, custom colors, status bar and quick settings. 
and also you are getting button which are so you if you want to flash this rom you will get these things so basically i love to see this actually the show me parts option because it's really help to um, calibrate your display and then what we are getting here so pixelizer and let's check our uh, my UI camera so if i open the camera so the camera is working so as you can see the camera is working fine and let's check our front camera so if i turn on the front camera you can see my phone so camera is working just fine and i think this is what all the good rom because in pixel pixel experience rom you will not get um, any kind of customization no miy camera and no xiaomi parts in pixel os you are you are not getting uh, xiaomi parts also no customization but you are getting a camera which is snapdragon camera which is which is not so good actually so overall this rom is uh, i think better one because you are getting a miy camera which is working just fine and also you are getting uh, uh, customization little customization and also you are getting uh, Xiaomi parts option so if you, you can tweak your display setting so that's it for today um, in for feature video I will give you a thorough review of this ROM about battery uh, backup and other things so thank you very much for watching see you next time